What's good? Classic intro spot, usual, but what's going on guys? I'm back again with another video. Today, I don't think I'm going to be doing too much vlogging. I'm going to be... Um, sorry if it's windy, you guys can't hear me very well. I just noticed that. I gotta get some like stuff to get on my camera to help with that. But what I'm gonna do right now is some back. Um, again, watch is dead. I never charge my watch, but it's 121. Oh, I opened it. My bad. It's 121. Anyways, so yeah, that's what's going on. Um, what else? I don't really know. What I just ate was um. Some chicken fried rice, some Chinese food that I got me last night that I didn't eat because I just wasn't that hungry. Because I also saw Black Panther last night, which was freaking lit. It was a great movie. I give it a solid 8 out of 10 for sure. And there's an op. Ready for this op? Three, two, one. 2, 1. There he goes. And he's gone. Alright. Well, as I was saying. So, basically, um... Yeah, I saw Black Panther, and it was pretty dang good. Pretty dang good, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I was extremely, extremely excited to see because I love Black... Excuse me, I love Black Panther. I think he's a great, great superhero. Probably one of my favorites right now. So, yeah, he's definitely up there. So, basically, 8 out of 10. Acting was like a 10 out of 10. I was kind of upset how they didn't use... Uh, this isn't a spoiler, so you're fine. Um, they didn't use a lot of the music that Kendrick put out for the album. They didn't use a lot of it. They only used like one song in the movie, and I was kind of bummed out. That's Kylan Raps for Kaylin. I don't know how you say it, but this dude is gonna be big one day. I'm telling you right now, this guy's a freak. This guy's got bars on bars. Anyways, back to the movie. Uh, yeah, it's been uh. I, don't know, I was really upset about that music part of it. Um, I was really looking forward to hearing some good songs because, like, King's Dead's amazing. I lifted, I love to lift it. That song goes because Kendrick just goes off. So yeah, that's what's going on. Current situation is my chucks as usual for lifting. Got my BM fit, slim fit joggers on right now, and rocking my Alpha Elite right here. I got. This uh, just T-shirt on. Just this one I got from uh, the Pump Chasers meetup, and yeah, that's really it. I'm gonna change this into my Pump Chasers hooded stringer though, cause yeah, that's what's up. So yeah, I will catch you guys at the gym. I'm gonna get some homework done at the gym today. So I'll see you when I get to the gym. What's going on guys? Welcome to the commentary part of the video. And this is a little tip and trick kind of video for you guys. So here's what I started off with. Today with this, I had back day, as I said prior in the video. And you can see I'm going very, very slow and controlled in this lap pull down. My arms are, are outside shoulder width. And I'm, uh, as soon as I come down, I'm protruding my elbows all the way down to my sides. Almost like I'm trying to bring them down into my lats or down into my hips. A lot of people will say, oh, keep your elbows forward when you do it. Keep your elbows forward. I, I, I have a lot of shoulder problem with that, and I did something that's very healthy for your shoulders. Um, in my opinion, shoulder impingement can happen, and we don't want that, and that's just that's like when there's no cartilage uh, in your shoulders, and that's just we don't want that. That just leads to injury, and we want good shoulders and healthy shoulders. Alrighty, and on to the next movement I did for back. This is a very simple back workout, guys. Nothing special, nothing out of the ordinary today. Um, I did a uh, V bar, if you want to call that a V bar, uh, close grip, you could say, a uh, lat pull down. I feel the best activation in these. Like, I really can feel a stretch all the way up there, and then I come back down and I squeeze, come back down. And guys, I'm not leaning back, like, all the way. I'm not like those, you know, those ego, like, douchebags in the gym that are, you know, like, they're pulling all that, all that amount of weight on there, and they're just, like, going way too heavy and they're leaning back too far. I barely have a little gangster lean, you could say barely a lean in there you see i'm stretching all the way up and i'm coming back down i'm squeezing all the way up coming down and squeezing coming down and squeezing guys this does not mean you need to use a lot of weight i didn't use a lot of weight here i could have done a lot more but i just chose i wanted you know i want to really isolate my muscles today i really want to try to focus and 
gonna get that mind muscle connection in there, guys, because time and attention is a great thing. Guys, I'm telling you that in every video. Time and attention is gonna be the only thing that really gets you that muscle. I'm telling you guys, it's really the only thing. And then um, I went over here and I did some uh, back rows. And I just, as you guys can see, we have this brand new piece of equipment at the gym and I love it, guys. It's like two cable systems in one. It's great, you can use it for almost literally anything. Um, it's by hoist and it, I just, it's just amazing. So what I did here, guys, I would try to stretch. I try to uh, keep my back level. I didn't do what Arnold used to do. I didn't go all the way down. I didn't like bring my, I didn't let the, I didn't let, la, 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 I can't talk, I'm sorry. I did not let the weight carry me. Um, I controlled the weight and I mean, I, I went forward so I felt a stretch in my lats and I came back and I squeezed. My elbows aren't going all the way behind my back either. That's the best part. And you guys can see, I we usually do drop sets with every single thing. And this is the last one we did for the day. Did a little bit of core work because my core needs some work. Everybody's core could get better. So uh, what I did here is uh, some straight leg raises. I can't do hanging ones because I always my momentum kicks in and I want to get like the full range of motion without cheating. And so I don't want lower back problems either. So what I'm doing here is when I did straight legs, eventually I got my legs are getting tired. And so I uh, just did some uh, knees to chest, knees to chest. And then I, I try going back straight out, but I know I was like, ah, I can't do it. I'm not going to be able to get it. I was like, oh, one, two, and three, and four. And I was like, ah, that's really it. That's all I got for the day. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little commentary, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. If you guys want more tips and tricks or more detailed ones, uh, just let me know. And I'll definitely get you guys those tips and tricks. So thank you. Thank you very much, guys. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're new. Alrighty guys, have a go and have a good rest of the day. Peace.